Hello guys, hey. welcome back. Um, today we're gonna watch another Band of Brothers. Yes, this one is part six. They call it Bastone or Bastone. I don't know. Bastone. Maybe it's another place because it sounds a little bit of French. Uh, ten, you know, tendency to be like French. So I think it is. We're so stupid when it comes. We're to dumb. Names. We're That's dumb. why we do this because we're dumb to do anything dumb. else. He's more dumb. <laughs> Dumb and Dumber. <laughs> dumb and Dumber. Should be a good uh, title to call our uh, channel, Dumb and Dumb. <laughs> and, uh, oh, previously, they're going to, well, I don't know where they're going, I forgot, but they were unprepared. They don't have enough yeah. ammo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, they but, took that place. It was quite sad. And it's, and it's no, the at the end of the, ah, yeah, 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 the, of end. the part was, they went there. They were, they were helping another Plateau, uh, battalion or plateau, yeah, yeah, whatever yeah. it was, but they don't have enough um, Anything ammo. Enough. Plus, it was very winter. Cold. It gets winter and cold. Oh, man, it's harsh. We'll see. Well, hopefully, something good comes out yeah. of this, right? Let's just jump into the video, guys. But if you're new to our channel, please don't forget to subscribe, tap the notification bell so we're notified every time I upload a new video. Yes. And of course, you're always welcome to visit our pattern if you want the full length versions. Exactly. Let's jump into it. When we left for. Passed on. Passed on. We were short of equipment. Yeah, the place. We didn't have enough ammunition. There was a ridge with a tree line. We were dug in on that ridge. Chairmans knew right where we were, and they really gave us a shellac. What? There's a fog was in. They couldn't drop us. Couldn't resupply us. Every time they tried to drop supplies into us, they missed us and dropped Man. us. Into Even today, a real cold night. We go to bed and. I, my wife will tell you that first thing I'll say is I'm glad I'm not in Bastogne. Man. Man. That is just so hard. Part six. Game I feel off. it's getting emotional. The part gets, you know. Yeah, it's we getting go along. near to the end. Oh, freaking snow. And you know in those times it's much colder compared now, right? Oh, yeah. Oh. Blood. Oh. Look at that. Mm. Oh, he's a medic. I didn't notice. Uh -huh. Oh, the like the water. Yeah. What is he doing? Oh no. Oh. Shaving his beard. Why would he shave his beard? I think it's more safer. Yeah, it's more it. warmer to let your beard grow. Look at me, it's summer and my beard is big. <laughs> I'm opposite. Uh oh. Mm, be careful who you shoot. Come as he here. Huh? Come as he here. Smell. Smell. Snell means fast or faster. He's <laughs> not even finished shaving. Doc, bandage. Take him back to regiment. We're under sporadic artillery fire, General. We're taking a lot of hits and we have no aid station. We run out of food, we have no winter clothes, and we have little or no ammo. Goddamn fog won't lift anytime soon, so you can forget about air cover. First battalion just pulled out a fort. Krauts on their tail. Tanks, artillery, got no back. Man. I have this feeling this episode is focused on this medic. Maybe. Uh, no plasma, a couple of bandages, practically no morphine. In fact, I try to find my way up to 3rd Battalion looking for supplies, but lost my way. Eugene, hmm. get everything you can. You're gonna need it. Eugene. Spina. Doc, what's happening? Digging in right along the line. Yeah. Yeah, this is it. Good to dig, you get warm. Oh, medic with medic. This is it? Yeah. That's all the supply they have? No, first battalion's pulled out of foyer. Heavy casualties. So if they're pulling back, then what the hell are we doing sitting here? We need morphine, that's all I got. You got extra scissors? Uh uh. Just the one. Two medics in one hole? Yes, sir. Mm. So what's gonna happen to us if you take a hit, huh? This is more like surviving than fighting. Yeah, in this weather, yep. You seen him? Oh. No. 
They're out there. Depend on it. Have a job, Doc? Go on. <gasps> they use their helmet, helmet for for coffee. Or soup or whatever they make. What about an extra thread in your aid kit, huh? How'd you morphing, guy? Medic. Oh, I like this book. It's focused on the medic. You guys hit? Oh, oh you crazy? Got a surrender. Uh -huh. Man. And the pressure, but when someone screams, medic. Man, I wish I was there to help them. Going back, dog. What? I ain't going nowhere. Not this shit. You don't want to go out in this shit and you yell at medic. I don't need to go back to no aid station. Well, you're in luck, man. You don't got no aid station. Right, well, you don't need this. Not yet. I do. <coughs> what is mm, Russians? So Russians so would be good in this weather. So he's taking aid kits from people to have. So he has his own supply. Yeah. All right, here. This is what I want you to do. I want you to take someone and work your way over to the third battalion, all right? You know what we need. Bandages, plasma, whatever you can beg, you beg. Man. All right, and give me some goddamn scissors. I can't get any. Oh, don't take your helmet. I don't really trust yeah. taking a helmet off. Sometimes it can be a lifesaver. It is a lifesaver. Hey, babe. Where the hell are we? Babe. The hell is their battalion? Ah, this is the medic. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Go, go. Scheiße! Oh! He fell on top of that guy or next to him? Sorry guys, but we just can't help you! Oh. Oh. It's a... Man, he's a messed up! In this hard situation, but you find the good things from small places. Hey, OG, <laughs> Lieutenant Dyke's got a full AK. Try him. Yeah, I'm sure he's not using his. Nah. <laughs> Maybe Hinkle's got a surat for you. Eat your strudel. Hey, Hinkle Winkle eats the armpit, huh? Winkle eats the armpit. The worst. Lieutenant Dyke. Hi, oh, Lieutenant Dyke. Lieutenant. Can you spare something from your AK, sir? I'm real short. I need surrets. Uh, morphine? Yes, sir. What happens if I get hit? I'll be there, sir. So what's in here, right? Yes, it is. Efron. If you don't die by the battle, you die by the cold weather sickness. Hey, listen, I need to know whether you kept your morphine from Holland. No, you asked me already, remember? No. Don't recall. Hey. Gordon, you want me? Oh, yeah. Uh, morphine. Used to look with scissors? Yes, I am. For Connie. Oh, careful. Okay. You guys okay? We got hot food. Can you smell it? Oh. Tony, show me your feet. You watched the goddamn line, McClung. Where are your boots? Washington up General Taylor's ass. I believe this. You can move better in bare feet, Doc. It's your size. Nine. Just like everybody else. My stuff. Oh, come on, Doc. What, you got a drugstore in here? But no, I ain't with my stuff. Well, what are you looking for? Scissors. Thank you, Picante. Oh, yeah, that guy said Picante has a scissor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, picking up Surrettes. Ali, leave God. You got any? No, guy, using Holland, Doc. He ain't using this stuff, are you, Doc? I mean, personal like. <laughs> come on. It's gathering from everyone. Yeah, because everyone has a, a aid kit from their whatever soup. Lieutenant. Make sure you move around a little, get your blood flowing. I can't feel my feet. Yeah, well, that's why you gotta move around, you know, so you don't get trench foot. Oh. Should I take my boots off? Uh -uh. All you gotta do is just loosen them up, keep moving. Yes. Oh! oh! The bones are out. No, it's not a bone, but it's oh. from like a uh, shrapnel. Shrapnel, yeah. Ain't that bad? No, Doc, save the morphine. I can make it. I can make it save it, okay? Yes. Yeah. Okay, let's get him out of here. Okay. The tanks, artillery, all pull back to here. We got no back 
They're gonna manage. Oh my god, okay. look at those bodies. You cannot bury them because it's hard to dig. Is he bad? No, low level, no morphine. Uh, uh, What's going on here? Why aren't these men evacuating? We can't evacuate, we're cut off. This is as far as it goes. Man, they're stuck in there. Uh, I need morphine, I need bandages, whatever you've got. Down to that. Your surgeon? No, we don't got no surgeon. What's what's this? Uh, from the bed. What sheets? Yes, bandages. Mm, they even use sheets. You gotta use what bandages. you gotta use, man. Yeah. My name is Rene. I'm Jean. Eugene Rose. Okay. Where are you from? Louisiana. Half Cajun. Can you get me back to the line? Sure. Good thing he has a uh, supply and yeah. few supplies. Eugene. Ah, he's taking boots for that dead guy. Body. What is Chocolat. that? Chocolate. Uh, Chocolate. For you. For you. For you. For you. For you. Comment t'appelles tu? I'm learning. Je m'appelle Lionel. Merci. Bring yeah, the I boots. think he took the boot for that guy who yeah. do, who with lost his feet. boots. God bless you all. Oh, yeah. Stay safe. That's it, guys. Nothing more to worry about. We're gonna die now. We're gonna die in the state of grace. That's it. Let's move out. Tactical columns, gentlemen. Doc, doc. It's a combat patrol. Why don't you uh, stay back and keep your ass out of trouble, huh? He stayed there. He stayed there. Someone screams medic. I think he's running there. Go. That's Julian. They said, like, the virgin. Go, go, go. I didn't see anything it's because of the fog. Man, you need to need to get him there, get him out of there. I don't think if he wants to move. Where well, he can go, he barely. Uh, oh my god, yeah, he's dying can. there. What's happening, sir? We're pulling back. Oh. We made contact. I gotta get to the CP. Oh. Oh. Huh? He wanted to save him. Man, this is so hard to watch. Oh! Oh! Man, that's a big hole, man. What the heck? What caliber they're shooting? Man, they're pushing them. Doc, we gotta move that Come on, let's go. Get him up. Move Doc, now, let's go. We could get to him, Captain. We tried, babe, tried. We could get to him. So far, this is so hard for them. Yeah. Everything is against them. The weather. They have not have enough supplies. Are you still having trouble with your feet? Huh. Show me. Let me. Let me see it. Oh. <gasps> They got frostbites! Or yeah. you know you say it? Frostbites, right? Oh, that's so painful. Strange for a toy. Strange for. If it turns gangrene, you could lose it. I ain't coming off the line, Doc. He doesn't want to leave, no? Well, you gotta stay dry. Massage your feet, change socks every day, and dry the wet ones around your neck. Oh. You seen that from? No. Why? He ain't in his hole. Maybe Heffron is trying to take that. Trying to take um Julian. Hey. Gotcha. Ah, he's here. He's there. Hmm. I promised him if he got hit, I'd get his stuff and bring it to his ma. You know. <sighs> yeah, that Julian. Should have got to him. But they will shoot you. Yeah. As well, because they were firing like without stopping, man. Oh. Hopefully, is there some air su air support? Probably. Yeah, because yeah, they're happy. 
Ah, they're dropping... What do you call that? Supplies? Oh, I have a bad feeling though. Maybe it's German. Oh, they have a star. Oh, oh, that oh, is... Oh, the Germans are following it. Ceasefire! Ceasefire, goddammit! No, they cannot do anything. Sorry, I don't understand. It was the wrong planes. Shh. It's a drop. It's a drop. It's a drop. Come on. It's a drop. Yeah. Well, why, why are they shooting? Oh, my that... goodness. So many drop. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Can even hear it. The artery. Gotta find the artery. Whoa! Oh my goodness. <sighs> oh, I got like a weird feeling in my body. Should I do pa? The artery. Why you want to find the artery? To sue it or what? He's gone. Mm -mm. Gonna find it. He was bleeding too much. Oh. 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 Your hands. You're a good nurse. I never want to treat another wounded man again. Mm. I'd rather work in a butcher's shop. Your touch calms people. That's a gift from God. No, it's not a gift. God would never give such a painful thing. Oh my goodness, this movie. I mean, this yeah. series. And this part. Man, where is hope in this? Yeah. Fighting every day with the cold, with the... Winter. Lack of supply. I mean, they have some supply. Yeah, there, they but... got now. It is better. Uh -oh. oh my god, what is that sound like? Tanks or what? Yeah, sounds like it, right? It's dark. It's gonna get busy, pal. Oh no. Hold your fire, boys. Don't let them draw you out. Oh, uh oh, it's gonna be the. So big is fight. the crowds of tanks. My mm. goodness. Stay ready. Oh. <gasps> mm. The shoulder, oh. and he burned himself. Oh Man, no! Man, there's so many! Oh, I didn't think you need to take cover, what? Yeah, you're staying so up. up. Doc, we gotta get the hell out of here. Yes. Stay with us, Doc. Hurry, Doc. Come on, Doc, I gotta get back to the line. Okay, okay. I got your ride, Doc! Oh, that was the, the, the other doctor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's his tag? Where's his tag? What's wrong with him? Paralyzed. What? He's paralyzed. He can't feel a thing. But where is his <laughs> tag? I don't know. I don't understand that. Eugene? Eugene? Are you... Are you alright? Hello, easy company. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. General McAuliffe sent a message to the entire division. General McAuliffe wishes us all a Merry Christmas. Oh, it's Christmas already. What's merry about all this, you ask? Now, two days ago, the German commander demanded our honorable surrender. Really? Save the USA encircled troops from total annihilation to the German commander. Nuts! Tell what? A Christmas to you all and God bless you. Nice, sir. <laughs> Well, that's easy to say. But this gives them a little courage. I don't know. If yeah, they are nuts for fighting this cold and staying there. Oh. Look at they're staying in a hole. No choice. I should try to do this for half an hour when it is winter. To dig myself a hole and stay like that there. Yeah, and you will see how it feels for them. I will not resist five minutes. But they have no choice back then. Picture of my girl. Good looking bright, Buck. She's finished with me. 
Yeah. The girl left. Yeah. Left him. Oh. <laughs> yeah. He's, uh... <laughs> what? It's the time for Christmas, huh? Mm. Just in time for Christmas. Lucky strikes yeah. means fine tobacco. Where the hell did you get those? Mm, never seen them smoking though. They run out of cigarettes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here you go, Pink. They're just sharing it. I'm shaking so goddamn much. I feel like I'm dancing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is so. I am laughing but about what they're saying, not their situation. Yeah. Frank, what is it? The Lemon powder snow cone. Oh, they're just making the best out of it, boy. Fire's not a good idea. Just a couple of minutes. Why, man? I guess they'll spot their yeah. position. I swear I thought I could smell a fire. I did smell a fire. Oh, no. Oh. Getting scared. Dog, you're very important. Come on, get up. The captain's yelling. Eugene, get yourself into town. Get a hot meal. Yeah. He's not judging them. He knows what they're going through. Of course. It's not easy, man. Oh my goodness. Of course they won't let them dro drop more supplies. Ah, uh, no, that's why no, they're doing that. Or maybe it's German who wants to bombard them. Even they're in town. Ah, uh, yeah, it is, because look, they're defending against those no. airstrikes. Yes, oh my goodness, it's even worse. Man. Oh my god, that's where they put their freaking patients. Supplies and the wounded ones. Yes. What town to get back and yeah. get any hot meal? No. What did he saw? That girl. Don't tell me it's the girl. <sighs> Her head's gone. Medic! Get your ass out here! Come on! How'd you do that? You did that. I'll fix it up. A wound. Yeah, yeah, you got a little bit. Cut. A knife, yeah. He's gonna use it anyway. Hey, Dean. Call me babe. I did? Because he always calls them by their names, not like the nickname. Babe. <laughs> <laughs> That's wrong. That's a goddamn line. <laughs> what line, man? It's. No, just in case, but they start shooting. They're, they're freaking stranded there. Yeah, they are now. Like right now, they're like stranded. In December 26, well, 26, yeah, 1944, General Patton stood on the boat through the German lines. Allowing supplies to flow in and, and the wounded, wounded to be evacuated. The story of the Battle of the Bulge, as told today, is one of Patton's coming to the rescue of the encircled 101st Airborne. Yes. General Patton. Mm. That's it? So General Patton came. I don't know. Did they, they just show who's General Patton here? No, no member of this has ever agreed that the division needed to be rescued. Oh, they didn't oh want it to be rescued. Because they were surrounded by. Yeah, but... boy. Man, oh. this 101st bat Battalion? Did you say it? Yeah. The 101st Division is insane. Next with that, level. With that situation that they have, they still believe that they don't need to be rescued. Man, oh my goodness. It's one of the saddest so far because yes, they had like a very tiny, very tough situation they were in. A tiny town like wrecked already, and they were kind of when they had like a wounded man, they get take it there, and even though they have limited supplies, they get I the wish, little supplies. I wish they would have shown the part where when General Patton came and you know they broke through the German lines. Yeah, I yeah. wish we would have seen it. Maybe it we'll was see. like maybe we'll see it next. 
I say. don't think they don't really show everything. They just know yeah. they show certain parts of that. What I like about this uh episode is they showed because you know I we started to notice that every episode they focuses they focus on, on one, someone, on, yeah, on someone or, or around that. Yeah, around that person, and then yeah. they focus on this Eugene. Uh, what's that? Eugene Rowe, uh, the yeah, medic. The doc. And sometimes you forget, Mangud, when you're just watching the the Band of Brothers, you forget because you're only watching the killing part, like yeah. the shooting and that, the planning. But the we we kind of tend to forget the part, the role of the medic. Yeah, we kind of remember Das. Yeah, I do remember when, <laughs> when I'm watching him. If you haven't seen, man, Das was that, fearless, lion man. Well, yeah, you, yeah, based on how on his belief that he doesn't want to carry a weapon or yeah, shoot. Yeah, but he had no. Yeah, but Fear. this, but what I'm saying is, like, the role of the medic in the war is very important, and it's still very hard because yeah. you you have to run through everywhere, course, going course. around looking for the wounded, bringing them, trying not to not trying not to be shot at the same time. Yeah, I mean, even though you're not the one shooting, but still, oh my god! I think even a, a medic when he was shot, because. Uh, they yeah. got you know yeah the situation. other guy the medical they felt bad also. because oh my god i cannot help yeah, them anymore. They cannot help. and even that guy that i don't know if i forgot his name the one he gave a shoe mm. like he's freaking it has like foot trench how they say yeah, trench yeah, yeah. foot First and bites. he doesn't even want to get out of that and he didn't want to stay there oh my god <laughs> these people's determination is because insane. you're detaching yourself from the hope that oh my goodness uh, let's just deal with this we end this and we go home no you you are you create a tiny world that you're meant to be just there for that and that is sad oh <sighs> my goodness well anyway guys we're just gonna end this episode yeah thank you for watching with us uh, don't forget to subscribe okay please do till next time we kiss you i will love you bye bye